Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back for another video. Today is a Liga BBVA slash Bundesliga squad, and uh, this squad is one of the best I've made. It's definitely one of the uh, most expensive squads I made. But uh, anyway, this squad cost me about 178k. Um, you could have different additions to the squad, like you could get somebody instead of uh, Jordi Alba, you could get a, a different Spanish left back. But uh, starting with the team, we have got Victor Valdez in net. Uh, of course, he I have used him before and his position is brilliant. His diving and his um, reflexes aren't the best, but with his positioning, it makes it all for him and he's definitely 85-80 goalkeeper. I could have got something like Inform Adler or Inform to Stegen, but I, didn't, I haven't used uh, Victor Valdez quite well now, so I'm going to try using him again. Uh, and he gives the 99 chemistry boost uh, from PK and I have used PK before on his own with uh, Mascherano and he was one of the standout players uh, as you can see here his stats and 62 pace might let him down but uh, just remember he's faster than Ronaldinho but, uh, by one pace but he's really good at defending when you press B button or whatever he really does get into those tackles and he's he might not be the paciest but he's a tank so next to him we have Mats Hummels who was a overpowered uh, just tank in 5th 12 8th 12 in 5th 12 he's got less pace now uh, he's got better defending and better heading uh, and seen him head the, the ball yet when I cross it in but he's a great player uh, and uh, one of the players you should get uh, so the left back now we have Jordi Alba now every time I play against some people uh, with my sub team Gomez well his sub team Lewandowski and Gomez always gets uh, shoved off by a uh, Jordi Alba I don't know why but it always happens uh, which is really annoying and, but he's just an overall like he's one of those fullbacks who are fast. He's like cliche and he's I don't say worth the coins, but he should drop down to about 10k, and that's the price that I reckon uh, he should stay at. So uh, coming with a bit of lag here, and I've just swapped the players with round backs. So uh, we have got Pijek now. Pijek, whoa, Pijek is a Dortmund. Star right back 86 pace 65 shooting 77 passing 80 defending 74 uh, dribbling and heading so uh, 82 rating for him he's quite strong and he's quite pacey but other than that uh, his defending isn't that good and he does lose the ball quite a lot I don't know if it's me but he certainly isn't the best uh, right back decision you could get you could get Philip Lahm but I had to get a uh, project because I don't want to try at Lahm he's not the best and every time I play against other people with Lahm I easily win so that's what set me back but CDMs we have got Busquets and Bender and they are both amazing so Lars Bender is only here for chemistry uh, reasons. I could have easily got Gundogan. Now, this is the problem with FIFA right now. Every time uh, I search for Gundogan, his price keeps going up, and I'm not paying 4k for Gundogan because I know I bought him for 2.4k before, so I'm, I just rejected that offer and I bought Bender. Uh, Bender's okay, but he's just a Bender, isn't he? So. Uh, next to him we do have Busquets. Busquets, I don't know why he's uh, 85 rating. His defending isn't great, his heading isn't great, pace is really bad, and he's got a decent passing and decent dribbling, but he's not that good. Uh, he's he's strong and that's really all. Uh, and he's um, costing me about 2.1k, but he's one for chemistry reasons. I've got uh, Alex Song, but I did need. Um, Busquets there. So since attacking mids, we do have Modric and Ozil, the two men from Real Madrid. Of course, you could get Kaká in here, but I did pick Modric um, after him, well before him, because even though he's a high rating, he's not actually that good. Uh, I don't know why. I think it's his hair distracts me from the actual game. But uh, he's he's quite fast. He's got decent shooting. 
good passing, good dribbling, and nothing else really. But he shouldn't be 86 rated, about 84, because shooting 83 is not that good, and he should not deserve a 86 rated card. Unlike Ronaldinho, who should, but uh, not going to that topic right now. I'm moving on. So, next to him on the opposite side, we have Mesut Ozil, uh, the man from Germany. 77 pace, 75 shooting, 85 passing, 88 dribbling, and he's actually quite small as well, I think. Oh, he's actually a decent height, but he's not that good at heading. But uh, Mesut Ozil does give me some. Like every time I play against somebody with Mesut Ozil, I always lose because he is, his shot's quite powerful and he's good at passing and dribbling. So uh, I am quite scared when I face Ozil. He's only averaging about 24k. So centre forward, we do have the man from Dortmund. Certain 90 pace, 84 shooting, 84 dribbling, 4 and 60 heading. But he is a 84 rated uh, man. From Dortmund, and his name is Marco Voice. Paid uh, about 16k for him, and he is really worth it. Every time I play against him, he is actually really decent, but a shot power not the best, and he links up with Urza and Bender. Now, up front, we do have the man from Real Madrid, uh, Benzema. Karlin Benzema, the best player, well, best striker for France and the best striker for Real Madrid so 85 pace, 83 shooting, 84 dribbling and 76 heading he is quite tall, well for a striker um, of his height that's quite decent and he's actually quite fast as well but 85 pace I do not feel that in game I actually think Modric is probably fast no Modric is probably at the same pace as him because when last time I played with him which was he was next to Falga, I think. I don't know who it was actually. I think I don't know who it was, but he did not do that well. Higuain, that's who it was, and he did not do that well. He's not. He wasn't that fast. Well, I did play against somebody, and he completely tore or teared me apart. Benzema, his shot power's decent. He's got good heading and he's got good dribbling with fast ass skills. Uh, Modric and Ozil and Royce and nobody else has got four star skills but uh, those four have got amazing talent and they are uh, meant to get you could build these in different type of teams with uh, I know Royce from Germany Ozil from Germany but, um, Modric in a hybrid squad like this or you could get just Benzema with a French team so uh, yeah, this team was 170k. Hope you like the music. Hope you like the squad. And thanks for watching, guys. Bye.